Now, how do you go about getting a suit? Do you pop down the high street, try one on? Perhaps you've had one specially made for a big occasion. Well, there are two ways to get that done. The first, bespoke, involves several fittings and a suit that's made from scratch, especially for you. <laughs> but of course. The second, made to measure, involves pre-designed patterns that are then put together based on your measurements. A subtle difference, but an important one. Now, it seems the first traditional bespoke method is a dying art in the capital, and here's why. Glenn Goodman has been to find out which suits you, sir. Usually seen hurtling through the streets of Bangkok, this nippy little motor is Harrod's latest wheeze for the city gent with more money than time. Meet the tailor on a tuk-tuk. <laughs> if you're simply too busy for a trip to the tailors, they'll come to you, any place, any time, and measure you up for a suit made by Xenia, the Italian designers. Make ouch. Well, David's convinced that made-to-measure is merely a half-measure and bespoke is the bee's knees. But be warned, a Henry Poole suit will set you back at least £2,600 and you'll have to go for several fittings. Harrods charge around half that. If Harrods are the hare, then Savile Row's the tortoise. But remember who won that race. Glenn Goodman, London Tonight, Central London. You weren't I really could, reading the news, were you? Not I, really. No, I wasn't really, <laughs> no, no. But he was a lovely guy, and I thought the funniest bit was when he was going up the staircase. Did you see the guy <laughs> yes, going down? Yes, okay. oh, what oh, are they doing? What's that all about? <laughs>